Hey, what's up guys? So finally I got my PlayStation 5 delivered to me basically a day after and just to, to give you guys a little backstory It was supposed to come yesterday around what like 3 p.m. But then basically FedEx decided to not give it to me yesterday <laughs> And I received it today for some reason at 11 a.m. I don't know what it was, but I finally got my PlayStation 5 so we i don't know man i'm so I, I, honestly i'm just so lost of words right now because this is the system i've been waiting for and i don't know man it's just this is so unreal like if you guys are seeing the back of the box right now uh the lightning speed the ssd the cpu blah 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 with the custom and everything yeah beth uh, breathtaking immersion stunning games i mean I, honestly this is this is so, so surreal that I have the PlayStation 5 with me. Honestly, I've been dreaming about the day to unbox it. And finally, we're going to do this. So I got my knife there, just trying to unbox this, this bad boy up. And yeah, man, I mean, it, it's so, so surreal that I actually have the PlayStation 5 and that I actually got to pre-order it back in September. I think it was 16, the day before, you know, when all that chaos happened. So yeah, I mean, I have the PlayStation with me. And honestly, I cannot be more excited than what I am right now, uh, just to see what's uh, what's inside the box. So yeah, I'm just opening basically the up uh, the box right here, and <laughs> I don't know. I'm just trying to like you know keep calm as much as I can, and I'm getting a little bit nervous, you know, trying to unbox this. I don't know. It's just this piece of hardware so gentle, and yeah. So we you know we opened it up. We got the cable right there. Uh, the stupid manuals, you know, that nobody, uh, nobody in the world is going to read. Not, not me. <laughs> uh, we got the cable, the power cord, and uh, yeah, just a standard power cord is not a big of a deal. Uh, but the main event, in my, uh, you know, in my opinion, the controller. I mean, honestly, me picking up that controller for the first time. You guys are seeing it right now. Uh, me holding it for the first time. Honestly, it was a surreal experience. Honestly, compared to the Dual Shock Four, this is a big improvement a massive improvement and it's just honestly one of the best controls i've held in my life actually and that's my wife right there trying to test the trigger out and you know she she actually says that she loves the controller a lot compared to the ps5 sorry the ps4 she loves this controller way more than uh the ps uh, than the ps4 controller she likes it a lot um she actually likes the white and the black she feels that you know the, this controller it feels premium because the quality build is way better it's a, it's a little bit more rougher than the ps4 controller the ps4 controller is a little bit more slippery in my opinion this one it feels a little bit more like a grip and then now we have the stand uh and I, <laughs> I had like a little bit of trouble trying to open the uh to see where i can get uh you know can take the stand out for some reason the little you know plastic thing was just too together but i finally got it out and um yeah just a standard stand um not big of a deal um it's not the best looking stand it's not the the most premium stand but it will do um instead of me wasting 20 dollars on a stand <laughs> you know playstation included one so that's nice that's a 2.1 uh, hdmi cable it's not as long as i wanted to because i'm trying to connect it to my OLED tv and put my playstation on the side so that's a kind of disappointing i might have to buy a cable for myself um but it, you know it's fine it's just a standard uh 2.1 uh, hdmi cable and now the main event actually <laughs> trying to take this uh, PlayStation out as gently as possible. I honestly do not did not want to like just drop it or just, you know, nick it. Just oh my god, I don't know. It's just me at that moment my heart was racing. Um just to see the beauty of the of the new PlayStation. And actually to be honest with you guys, I love the design of the new PlayStation. And uh but yeah, I'm just like right there a little bit nervous to take it out. And, uh, and honestly, to be honest with you guys, that thing, that PlayStation is surprisingly incredibly heavy um, compared to like what I was thinking in my mind it was going to be. Uh, it is pretty heavy. I don't know what it was, but like when I got the box, right, when I when I hold the box for the first time, uh, the target box that came in, it was it was not it was heavy, but not that much. But holding it up right now, it's actually a pretty, pretty heavy console. Uh, but I like it like that. And my wife was just touching the the boards of the the borders of the PlayStation, and it's it has that little texture on it that uh, it just feels premium. It looks premium, and that's the only thing I probably don't like about the PlayStation is the black thing, the the glossy black. Um, if it was matte black, then it will be perfect um, because I really don't want to clean it all the time, and you know because it's very fingerprint, you know, uh, magnet, I guess. 
um, but yeah I mean here we are in the back of the PlayStation the two USB uh, 3.1 um, connections the HDMI the Ethernet and the power supply thing um, so yeah I mean it's a uh, pretty nice uh, looking PlayStation the textures inside you see the Sony logo over there um, and yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to say about this console. It's like, I'm just trying to see, just trying to basically talk around here, but I just don't know what else to say. I'm just starstruck with this console. It's a beautiful looking console. It's not that thick as I thought it was going to be. It's actually pretty thin on, it's pretty thin, but it's just a giant ass console. Uh, but yeah, guys, that's basically the unboxing of this video. Uh, thank you so much uh, for tuning in. Right now, I am actually going to, uh, after I post this video, I'm going to stream Miles Morales in 4K. So if you guys want to um, if you guys want to see that, then of course, hit the subscribe button, like this video, and uh, support the channel. That's basically the best way you guys can do it. I'm going to pump out so much content now that the PS5 is out. And I honestly just want to say thank you to all of you guys who have supported the channel since day one. And it's because of you guys that this is possible and that I wanted to get this PS5 day one so thank you so much and just like the video subscribe to my channel and just wait uh probably like an hour and i'm going to start streaming uh miles morales in 4k so stay tuned for that stay positive stay safe keep playing and i'll see you guys next time thank you so much for being the best supporters any youtuber can ever have <laughs>